guys, what's going on? Brian back with another live stream. So today we're going to be starting Death Stranding Director's Cut. Now, this is one of those games that I kind of, I, I did what I tell you guys not to do. And I went and listened to, you know, the reviews of people who probably only put two or three hours into the game and wrote it off and just decided, ah, oh, this game isn't for me. Um, it's boring. It's this, it's that. And I just ran with that and just automatically, you know, made the assumption that I will not like this game and I'm not going to play it. But after a while of meeting more and more of you guys, uh, you know, throughout the time that we've been on the channel, uh, there's been a lot of you guys that are like, no, this game is ab absolutely amazing. Uh, check it out. Game is amazing. Game is amazing. Story is amazing. This is amazing. Game looks great. And then I started to say, oh, well, why the hell am I, you know, listening to people who probably actually didn't put any time into the game, probably never even beat the game. And uh, I'm going to I'm going to play it and I'm going to build my own assumption. So here we are, guys. We're going to be playing Death Stranding. And uh, I'm definitely excited. Hopefully, if, you know, you guys are in the same boat as me and, you know, kind of wrote this game off because of reviews of people saying stuff. Uh, hopefully, you know, maybe we can all come to the conclusion today uh, or, you know, if, if this becomes a series. Like I said, if you guys do want this to be a series, make sure you smash that like button. Uh, it's the best way to let me know that you guys are enjoying the content. Also, if you are new to the channel and want to help out, uh, you know, the road to 100,000 subscribers, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. It really does help also. So... Let's go, guys. Now, as you guys know, this is a game made by Kojima, uh, which is the guy who made uh, Metal Gear. And if you guys know Metal Gear games, they all have those weird stories to them, the weird enemies and shit like that. So this being a Kojima game, I expect that same level of weirdness. Like, that is, you know, just to be expected when you're playing a Kojima game. And, uh, yeah, here we go, guys. Here we, here we go. <clears throat> so right off the bat, you know, now the one thing is, um, I know this game has copyright music. Uh, it is, it, it is what it is. Um, I'm going to be, we're going to get demonetized, but if you guys like, you know, so even if we're demonetized, we're not, uh, you know, obviously I don't get paid for doing the stream at that point. Um, if you guys are still enjoying it, I'm still going to play it regardless. It doesn't matter because at the end of the day, you know, I'm, I, I, I mean, I'm here for the game. You know what I mean? Nathan with the nine months. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. All right. You guys ready? Uh, this game. So, yeah, 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 yep. Uh, uh, we'll just go normal. I, I don't know. Uh, start the selected difficulty. This difficulty can be changed at any time. Okay. So if we want to make the game harder later on, we, we can do that. Uh, normal, large. Normal, large. We'll go normal. I don't, I'm not that old yet. Uh, new additional content found. Power gloves. Additional items can be fabricated once the base version is... Okay, I don't know what that means. Uh, it's probably like some DLC shit. It, it kind of has the same uh, UI as like uh, Metal Gear 5. Okay, screen brightness. Uh, just screen so the image on the right can be seen, but the image on the left cannot. Facts. Uh, indicated doom abilities, very suffering. Okay, what? Um, my month is. Yes, I mean, sure. Whatever. One one. Hey, I have a control. That's why I got my damn controller plugged in. <clears throat> Just do it on the moon? Max, thank you so much for the super chat, brother. <laughs> Here's your monetization. I appreciate it, brother. Here is your monetization B. Uh, along with the stick, there are two mankind oldest tools. The stick to keep the bad away, the rope used to bring the good towards us. They're our first friends and our own invention, wherever we're for the people. Okay. 
Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave birth to time and space. Once there was an explosion, a bang which set a planet spinning in that space. Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion. Just like that, demonetized. That shit looks good, though. It's Looks fucking dope. There must be some <laughs> that looks dope, man. Don't be so serious. Don't be so serious. Don't be so serious. Caspi, you aren't lying, brother. There is cars bikes and shit in this game. There he is! <laughs> That's some fucked up ass rain, dude. Bro, the deer died, bro. <laughs> dude, that's fucked, dude.
So am I supposed to grab this over here? I don't It's a cave. Oh. Oh. oh shit! Nice. Good way out the rain over there. So it seems like the suit we're wearing um, protects us from that rain, because that shit seems really, really bad. Here's my man, Norman! Yo, it looked like we hit a lady, though, with an umbrella. Where'd she go? She probably got melted. Shit got him breaking out like that was one fucking raindrop, dude. Christ, dude.
Why are they crying? I think they're gone. <laughs> what the hell? Didn't mean to grab you so hard. Tears. A chiral allergy. So, you have dooms, like me. I've got the extinction factor. But I think you got me beat. What's your level? You can see them, right? No, but I can sense them. Level two, then. What are you doing here? Trying to stay dry. Same as you. Time falls let up. My name is Fragile. Yeah, I've heard of you. <laughs> that right? Some Porter Bridges. See all the handprints on them, dude? The man who delivers. Enjoyed that Wanna shit. Come work for me. Must be tough out here on your own. Yeah, I thought Fragile Express had plenty of people. Plenty of traitors. Not much left of us now, save for a few honest folks. And on top of that, not much left of me either. Got soaked from neck to toe. I can't help you with that. I make deliveries. That's all. There it is. This is Bridges Central Dispatch. Freelance contractor Sam Porter Bridges. Receiver is standing by for drop. Headed into town. Watch yourself. Those things never stay gone for long. Time for fast forwards, whatever it touches. But it can't wash everything away. The past just won't let go. I'll see you around. Sam Porter Bridges. The time fall. So the, they call the rain time fall? I thought it was burning shit. Like like acid, but it ages shit. So that he got that wrinkle on his hand. I thought it was like an acid burn, but it was actually aging. That's crazy. Okay, so uh, order number one, smart drug delivery. Deliver one or more consignments of smart drugs. Um, the red bar is blood gauge. When it reaches zero, Sam will die. The blue bar is stamina gauge. As stamina depletes, Sam moves more slowly, and maintaining his balance is harder. Okay. Okay. So how do I do the... How the hell did I do that? The little ding earlier. I don't remember which way we... Oh, shit. Stop running down the hill, dude. We got to figure out where we got to go. Um, okay, so we don't have nothing equipped there. That is a canteen. Um, 
Okay, so that restores energy. This game is is gorgeous. Okay, I'll be careful because I don't want to lose my balance on here. There we go. Oh, was it Q? There it is. Smart Drug Central Station. Okay, we're getting there, guys. Can I walk in the water? Okay, it takes out your endurance as you're crossing. Can I put this on my back, actually? Yep, we can. Looks like there's something up there. Let's go check and see what that is really quick. So I think that's the location we got to go. So we can carry up to 120. So what if these were all originally my packages? I don't even know if I can cross this. Get up there, get up there, get up there. I wonder if I'm uh, stacking too much shit on my back. <laughs> We're gonna have like. Ten feet of packages coming off our back, dude.
So there's tons of lost cargo all over the place. Oh, this one is huge, though. Emergency provisions. We're just approaching cargo weight limit. So I'll just hold this one in my hand. Beginning scan. Cargo verified. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, there's vehicles right there, dude. Huge, thank you for the sub, man. I appreciate it. We got a lot of weight here. We got to be careful, man. I'm sitting here trying to... Ooh, shit. Trying to bring everything back. Okay, so uh, holding down buttons. Hold on. F Try holding it down until the delivery terminal responds. Okay, so make deliveries. Uh, eight pieces of new cargo can be delivered. One order can be completed. Let's do it. Okay. So, complete order. All cargo is required. All cargo required is ready to be delivered, and your order can be completed. Let's do it. And then these are all just returns, right? Had to wait out the storm. Lost my bike. Sounds like you've been through the ringer. Luckily, our goods are in perfect condition. Well, you did keep us waiting, but everything else seems to be in perfect order. So. Had taken for the 15 Great months, work. man. We'll be awaiting the next delivery. No damage. 1% damage on that one. Uh, distance traveled. Look at that, guys. 1,305 meters. I wonder how big this map is. We got an S rank for that. Um, Caspi said the map was pretty big. Is it like Ghost Recon Wildlands big? That's a big-ass map. I don't understand what the likes are for. Is that like money? Okay. Disposal team. Igor, Bridges Corpse Disposal. Sam Porter, I presume? Right. Not the touchy feely type. Talkman said you had some kind of phobia. Bridges Corpse Disposal? What happened? Look, gotta get a move on. I'll explain as we go. Come on. I'm gonna take a look. He's got a date with the incinerator. How long since he flatlined? 
We don't know the exact TOD, but I'd say it's been upwards of 40 hours. He wasn't quarantined. I'm not sick. This is a suicide. Oh, Jesus. We're just lucky we found him at all. Got him on ice ASAP, but who knows when he'll go necro. What are they talking Where about? Where are you taking him? Uh, closest incinerators to the north. This route's crawling with PTs. Sure you can't use another? I wish I could, but there's no time. Then just burn the poor bastard right here. You put all that Kyrillium in the air so close to town? Can't do it. Better that than trying for the incinerator. Hey, we can do this. We just need someone like you with dooms. Well, he's already in the first stages of necrosis. If we don't hurry, this place is a crater. So how about it? Can we count on you? What the fuck is going on? So dying is is, is a bad thing? A contract with Sam Porter. Sam. Just Sam. And I can't spot BTs. Just sense them. That's why we came prepared. A bridge baby, huh? With its help and you, we'll be able to stay one step ahead of them. Makes me feel like shit every time. Well, you are plugging into the other side. Freaks me out too. Roll out. He said something about a crater, though, like. Now we have, now we know that corpse disposals. <laughs> it's a it's a rough job, guys. You know, the world was different when I was a kid. America is a country. Anybody could go anywhere they damn well pleased. No need for couriers like yourself. We had highways, airplanes. Hell, we could even visit other countries. Oh, look at that city. <laughs> Hard to imagine it now. As you can see, the Death Stranding poked us full of holes. Fucked us beyond all recognition. And if you were lucky enough to survive, the time fall came and washed you away. Then those freaks from the beach showed up. The worlds of the living and the dead all mixed together. And that's when folks started holing up in the cities. Couriers like yourself got put up on a pedestal. Incinerator. This guy's about to pop. Shit. We're up to cut to the BTs. Get us out of here.
Oh fuck, that dude got all the rain on him.
Why are we butt ass naked? Fucker, those dudes floating in the sky. There it is. You don't walk near the creepy singing bitch, like, that's not what you- Fuck, they weren't lying about a crate. So, a, there was a dead explosion. body did that? A bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion. An explosion that will be our last. Yo, that, that shit was 
That shit was something else, guys. I don't I don't even know how to explain what I just seen. Like, how does a, a person's brain even like develop something like that? Like I couldn't think that type of shit up if I wanted to. I don't even know what we just seen. That shit was dope though. It was dope. Couldn't tell you what it is. Those invisible things are scary as hell. The whole baby inside the thing and then the... Oh, that shit was... Put them with the super chat. Thank you so much. it feel to be back in the world of the living? Don't worry. I'm a doctor. Well, a coroner. Originally. Finished this the other day. Incredible. Enjoy X. Call me Dead Man. I'm well acquainted with the dead. Not like you, of course. Contrary to the name, I've never actually died. I would advise against that. I'm no expert, but I can assure you it's for your own protection. See? So I'm a prisoner. These aren't handcuffs. They're cutting-edge devices that keep us all connected. Us? Oh, us. Yup. Bridges. Humanity's best Scotland, thank you for the for the future. Acid. It's got to be or acid. Avoiding extinction, <laughs> if you prefer. Right. Where am I? What time is it? Watch me. Try pressing it against your skin, like this. Relax. That just means your body's got a good connection to the cufflink. Look. Look. Cuffs will watch over you 24 hours a day. That is to say, we will. We're here to help. What the hell? Two days. During that time, we took the liberty of collecting fluid samples from you. You're a repatriate. That makes you very special. What happened to the CD guys? Central Knot was obliterated in the Annihilation. Game over, man. Place is a crater. The only ones to get it continue were you, for obvious reasons, and your broken bridge baby. Is it all right? Uh, it's been marked for disposal. Didn't work anymore. Why keep it? Uh, we lost everyone. Not just corpse disposal. My team, HQ, all of Redford, every soul in Central North City. The explosion was that big? We're at our base in Capital North City now. Or should I say, our new headquarters. Sudbury seemed the logical choice. But. Our implementation team has been decimated, and there's only so much they can do in two days. Things here are a mess. Fortunately, the director and his support team were out of town at the time, so the chain of command remains intact. I hate to do this so soon, but... I have a job for you. Huh. Uh, uh, this stencil is from when you repatriated? Uh, what's the other mark from? A clingy woman in a cave. 
Mm, I see. Affenphosmphobia. No wonder you were out there alone, where no one could touch you. I'll try to be more careful, Sam. So, uh, the job is an urgent delivery. I need you to bring the president some morphine. Huh? What president? America's gone. The whole, talking about the mayor the whole fucking tomorrow. president, dude. No, 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 no. Not the mayor. America lives on, Sam. The president is in the final stages of cancer, in critical condition, but there's still time. Why me? Look, Sam, do as I ask, and I promise it will all make sense. Why don't you do it? Because I'm not really here. <sighs> Apologies. This is just a chirogram. And here oh, come the tears. Allergic reaction to the chiral transmission. I'm actually over in the isolation ward in the big triangle building. Ah, here is the morphine. Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Come on, you got morphine there. What's this about? Tell me the truth. The truth, Sam, is that America's last president wants to see you in person. Are you really about to say no? Yeah, dude, I, I would say no. Very good. I'll see you in the isolation ward. Thank you for the sub, man. Okay. Check the map on your cufflinks if you're lost, Sam. The isolation word should be pretty obvious. If you're not sure how to get there, you can set markers and draw routes, too. Try it out, and you'll see what I mean. Okay. Okay, so there's the isolation ward right here. Oh, there's a fucking crater, dude. Alright. Oh, so you can place markers? What? Oh! Okay, okay. And then you can... Hit all your div- I see, I see, okay. Too easy, dude. Alright, what, push Q? Right there, pop up. Not that I really needed one for such an easy... Sam, if you want to confirm you're headed the right way, check your compass. It'll never steer you wrong. Provided you have a destination, that is. 
Press G to enter compass mode. Well, I put B down and I really don't need to go to B, so... Behind you like that, don't scare the shit out of me. Home to Bridges HQ. It was also the seat of the Reconstructionist movement. If the president hadn't required special treatment, she would have never left. And if she hadn't, we wouldn't have either. Cruz with the three months. How you doing? It's been an amazing three months. 100k around the corner. Eh. We're getting there. We're getting there. Thank you for the three months, though, Cruz. I do appreciate it. Trending the same way. Oh wow, there's a no lot more people really still right. alive than I, I thought. I no. We should start making preparations. Sam. It's me, dead man. Sorry, my mistake. I'm afraid the president's condition has deteriorated. Thank you. This will help to ease the pain. And allow her to speak with you in these final moments. Her? The first and last female president of the United States. Surely you remember her. She raised you? You're not exactly dressed for a reunion. Take that off before you come inside. Good man, thank you for the sub. That's the president's right-hand man. The director of Bridges. Why is he had a cool-ass mask on? Die hard, man. Oh, you were with Bridges one? So, I guess no introductions are necessary. What's it been, Sam? Ten years? Look at us. A bunch of deathless freaks meeting like this. Yeah, well, good to see you two. President's waiting. It's your mother, Bridget. She's a bit out of it, but I know she'll recognize you. Madam President, we've brought Sam. <sighs> we 
we'll leave you two alone. Sam, I knew you'd come back. Are you doing all right? She was kind of looking like Carol from The Walking Dead for a sec there, wasn't she? Amelie. Amelie. You remember Amelie went west. Took her three years to cross. She's trying to rebuild the country. So, you know, it's a Walking Dead reunion. Still going on about that, huh? You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. Help Amelie, she needs you. <laughs> Together, you, you can help us reconnect. <sighs> you can make America whole. Sam, if we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. We don't need a country, not anymore. We do. Alone, we have no future. No, America's finished. Bridget, you're the president of Jack's shit. Sam, listen to me. <laughs> bro, you better listen. Your mom is killing herself right now to even have this conversation with you, bro. for you on the beach. <gasps> Madam President! Oh, no. Oh. Doctor, we need your help. Don't they gotta hurry up and get rid of the body? None of that was real? Listen, no one can know that the president is dead. If word gets out, Bridges is finished. Now what happened here does not leave this room, do you understand? Yes, Director. But there's still the matter of the body. Without corpse disposal. We've got that covered.
Sam, before she died, the President made a contract with you. What are you talking about? As a member of Bridges, you're gonna work with the rest of us to rebuild America. You think you can recruit me? Like she tried to? Well, she succeeded. Look at your wrist. If that's not symbolic, I don't know what is. Director, the cancer spread throughout her entire body. Harvesting organs is out of the question, and there is no need for an autopsy. Her body needs to be cremated before she necrotizes. And if we don't, this place will turn into another crater. What do you want me to do? We don't have any porters right now. And the CD team you went into the field with are dead. But the President's body has to be burned. The road from Capital Knot City to the incinerator was compromised in the void out. Now the only way there is on foot, through the mountains. But the chiral density there is off the chart. It's gotta be BTs. This job has requirements. Tombs. Repatriate. So me. Why? Sam, you're already on the clock. Now get it done, Sam Porter Bridges. President Strand believed in American Reconstructionism. She worked tirelessly to bring the nation together again. And without her, there would be no bridges. She deserves a funeral with full honors. But we can't give her that. If she dies, America dies. Without her, bridges will cease to be. Listen. Her cremation must be carried out with the utmost secrecy. Even if we pull it off, what then? Who's gonna take her place? Face it, America's history. Sam, America isn't dead yet. He just said that it dies if Bridget dies. She may be lost to us, but we still have an America worthy of the presidency. I'm sorry, what? Let's not get into it now. What matters is that we're going to finish your mother's work and rebuild America as she intended. That's the reason Bridges exists. So take the first step, Sam, and deliver the President's body to the incinerator. If we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. I love you, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Facilities to the southwest. Remember that you'll be passing through BT territory. We built the incinerator way up in the mountains so that the chiral matter in the smoke wouldn't reach the city. It won't be easy carrying a body up there. We'll be monitoring you around the clock. If anything comes up, we'll offer you support by the cufflinks. That's wicked, man. No. All right, so let's, uh, let's check the map here. Getting to the incinerator will be anything but easy. Move around and change the angle of your map to gain a better understanding of the terrain. See if you can't pick a path to your destination. 
For this order, we've provided you with a number of suggested routes as well. Ultimately, though, it's up to you to decide how you want to proceed. Okay. So this cliff face looks pretty sketch. Um, we gotta go through water this way. This way looks pretty straightforward, but as we get to the end here, it looks like it could be a little sus. I don't know, my, my, my might go this top, this flat, oh, the flat route, I was gonna say, I might go this top route here. Yeah, we'll go, we'll go this top route here. Okay, so when people die, instead of turning into zombies, they turn into uh, invisible creatures of destruction. Dude, we're gonna fucking totally drop this body, dude. So yeah, we're going to follow the road out to the end here. I'm trying to not drop her, though. So that'd be President messed up. Bridget Strand was the symbol of American Reconstructionism. Even with the country shattered and its people scattered to the four winds, she never stopped believing they could be reunited. People held on to their hope that America would rise again because they believed in her. We believe that this country can be rebuilt. America lives on, together with Bridget's undying spirit. There it is, you heard it here first, guys. Have a pleasant journey. Thanks, dude. Nothing like carrying a body. Okay, let me see. Make sure we're still heading towards our... Yep. So first waypoint's gonna be on the other side of that hillside there. Yeah, yeah, just like that. Just make sure we're doing some proper land navigation here. I know your voice, I know your face. The 
Not my music, no. It's in the game. Almost it. Let's be real, chat. How many of you guys dropped the body? What is that? Oh. Oh, let me pick it up. I, I checked before. There's no way to fucking turn off the music. Because I, I was like, oh, man, we're going to get hit with, like, copyright and shit. But when you come to the audio settings, like, there is just no turn off music button anywhere. It just, it's in the game. Your face hurts really bad. What do you mean? And there's no way to turn the music volume down either, guys. I, I checked that too. There's zero music controls. We gotta go up over this hill. Great. Did you go take a shower and wash it off? There we go. Oh. Uh, when stamina decreases, uh, hold three to drink from the canteen. All right, so we already hit our second. Just a bit further now. Okay, so see us up that way. There's online elements to this game um, where, like, players can, like, build shit. 
and you can like have access to I turned it off though because I didn't want like the experience to be like different. I wanna, you know, do it myself, I guess. But players can like leave like construction and and I think even vehicles and signs and shit like that. It brought it up when I first turned the game on. I ended up, I turned it off. I probably had my pack up. I got irritation. Are those bodies floating? Huh. So that's the place, huh? Just like that, guys. We already made it. Um, but in the military, I've definitely easily have had 80, 90 pounds uh, just in the pack. Plus, you know, your armor, uh, ammo, stuff like that. Generally, your average carry weight is you'll carry about, you know, rifle, ammo, everything like that. About 120 pounds worth of gear and equipment. Wet, you know, because you... You can have empty canteens and shit like that, but yeah, if you're they anywhere from 100 to 120 pounds, 80 to 120 pounds, maybe. But generally not too much heavier than that. That would suck. <sighs> Do the thing for the sub. Here we go. That wasn't a bad trip. All right, so cremate, place the body in the incinerator. Let's do it. means it's gonna rain Sam burn the other cargo while you're there what's this BB 28 it's the unit Igor was assigned it was hooked up to you when we found you in the crater but why is it here 
because it's flagged for disposal. Central Knot's gone, and our headquarters along with it, because that thing didn't do its job. It's all in Igor's logs. But it's still alive. It can't be repaired, and it can't survive outside the pod. Pity it if you want. But the decision has been made. It has to go. The director approved the order. He wants to burn the baby? Okay, so the flat route, straight through to BTs. Shortest route, straight through to BTs. BT evasion route. Dude, we're going the shortest route straight through the BTs. What do you mean?
I can't see him playing any other character except Daryl from The Walking Dead. Graphics look dope. Flexed biceps, medium dark skin tone. <laughs> Keep it, thank you for the super chat, man. Got a fucking rope down. Thank God. It's only 20 meters, okay. I mean, we're good, we're down pretty much. Chris with the super chat, thank you so much, dude. We made it, guys. Not bad. I want to thank you guys for over 400 likes on the stream. Oh, wait, let's drink up some of this. I said the best way to let me know that you guys are enjoying this and definitely want to see more. Hey, just smash that like button, guys. Well. Thank you for your... Yo, Igor is a good dude. Who the hell is Igor, man?
wonder what those little things are. Those are the little worms, I believe that lady, but I don't understand, I don't know what they do exactly. Not bad. We delivered our first real mission. Burning the president's body. Just like drive one of these? Sam. I can't. Come back to the distribution center. Check the location on your compass. I just realized that whole time we were out there, we were wearing one of the corpse disposal team uh, uniforms. There's no way. No way you're burning the baby, bro. I'll fight everybody. It's not happening. Sam, I thought I told you dooms and BBs were a dangerous combination. Huh, perhaps a shower is in order. You're still covered in chiralium. Don't want the president to see you like that. The hell are you talking about? She's dead. <sighs> You're upset. Is this about BB-28? Go fuck yourself. I'm not your errand boy. Well, in any event, it seems it owes you its life. No, we are the You see the flipping them off, dude? Too. As you say, I shall look after it. Give my regards to the president. Oh, George, thank you for the super chat, brother. I appreciate it, man. 
Game slick since lately. I've been uh been fire. Appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you, man. I'm glad you're enjoying them, brother. It's almost time to go, Sam. Here. It's a dream catcher. Wear it when you sleep, and I'll keep the nightmares away. I'll always be with you. Oh, I'm like, can't tell the difference between like the gameplay and the. Check BB under construction, weapons rack under construction. Why are you drinking it like a savage? That's what we were trying to do. He didn't even get to finish washing his feet, bro. You did well, Sam. Thank you. Bridget may no longer be with us, but her legacy has a chance to live on. Bro, what a cool ass mask like that. How the fuck does he get that mask, me. dude? America. Reconstructionism. Her dream isn't dead. I don't want to hear it. This is the face of our new hope. Our new America. Homily. That's that person we keep seeing in the dream, isn't it? My mother may be gone. But I'm here. And you, Sam? You're here too. Been ten years since you saw each other, right? And in all that time, she hasn't aged a day. He knows why. My body's still on the beach. I don't get to grow older. But 
you do, Sam. You look good. So you're serious then about reconnecting everyone and everything? Someone has to succeed Bridget, Sam. More importantly, someone has to carry on her legacy and see our country rebuilt. Samantha America Strand, our new president. A new beginning for our people, for our nation. Under Emily's leadership, we'll reestablish the UCA, the United Cities of America. This is how we'll rebuild our country. But we'll need your help to do it, Sam. No, I'm through with this. I said my goodbyes to all of you when I said them to Bridget. We never forgot about you, Sam. You ran away. You cut us off. Emily put together an expedition. The best of bridges won. And went west. I led them past craters in BT territory. I kept them safe while they searched for survivors. Never once missed a BT. Saw them coming a mile away. We convinced community after community to join the UCA. And we left behind our own people to help them. It took us three years, but we managed to make it all the way to Edge North City. All the way to the Pacific? Jesus. Yeah, but then everything went to hell. The team was wiped out, and Emily was taken. Taken? I'm not being kept in a cell or anything like that. I'm allowed to use their facilities and to speak with you whenever I want. I just can't leave the city. It's all to safeguard the continued independence of Edgenot City. Well, that's what her keepers are saying, at least. They want the UCA to leave them be. Emily's their insurance policy in case we don't. Who are these assholes again? Homo Demons. Militant separatist group. They run Edgenot City. I've heard of them. Bunch of terrorists who go around town. Oh, dude looks badass as fuck, dude. Craters. Right. Nothing's off limits for them. Not even engineering void outs. You think the suicide that took out Central Knot was one of theirs? Could be. There are extremists like the demons everywhere, plotting in the shadows. They're decentralized by nature. No one organization to rule them all. Just a common ideology. I know not everyone shares our vision for the future. If we Americans don't come together again, humanity won't survive. I carried my mother's message to people all across the country. But not everyone was willing to accept it. More than a few would rather stay isolated. Keep to themselves. Go it alone. Like you, Sam. They think that America can only be rebuilt by force. By men who tell them what to do. Who take away their freedom and put them in shackles. What'd you put on me, huh? You know better than the demons. Just another kind of cult. They're not shackles, Sam. They're a symbol of our bonds. That's what we need right now. Not to stand But you apart, didn't even give me the option, together, dude. He just put it on. Car will not and reconnect. Sam, we want you to go west and finish what Emily started. The people she left behind have been hard at work setting up Cairo network terminals. But these terminals are still isolated. We need you to bring them online. And for that, you'll need a cupid. I gotta go across the whole America, bro? This contains all the necessary security and operations protocols to integrate a terminal into the Cairo web. Take the Cupid West, Sam, 
and reconnect the people of our great nation. And when you get to Edgenot City, find Emily and bring her home. After that, I'll take over the presidency and carry on Mother's work to save the country. This was Bridget's dying wish. This is how we'll move forward. Please, Sam. We need you. I'm Sam Porter Bridges now. I'm not a strand. Hell, I'm not even part of this outfit. You all saw to that. I'm not getting involved with you or anyone else ever again. Wait. It's cold as fuck, bro. See? It's like I'm not even here. Same as it ever was. Sam! Sam! Hold on. Stop! Listen to me. America needs you. Both of you. Yeah, covering the world in cable didn't bring an end to war and suffering. Don't act surprised when it all comes apart if you try to do it again. Round and round it goes. Connect, reconnect, it's not that simple. All right, all right, Sam. Just take it easy. I get it. You don't have to commit to anything now. Why not get some rest? Good idea. We all need our sleep. Leave it too long and you're liable to reconnect with the other side. The necessary maintenance has been completed. Various adjustments and fine-tuning for your benefit. You can use it again. For once, it would seem that Dooms and BBs are a good combination. <laughs> or perhaps the two of you have something of an affinity for one another. Damn, yeah, this little baby, dude. Macro! Hey, with the donation. Thank you so much. So you find a game and play this one. Yeah, I, I did. I'm actually enjoying it quite a bit so far. This story is awesome, man. It's like a fucking... It, it, it's, it's pretty legit. Confusing. But legit. Sam. <gasps> Listen. You are Sam Strand. No, not, not anymore. My name is Sam Porter Bridges. It's a funny word, strand. A strand is part of rope or bond. While stranding means being washed up on the shore. And being stranded is when you can't go home. I'm stranded now, Sam. Here on the shore of the Pacific. Thousands of miles away, but our bond still holds. You're free, but we're still connected. Don't tell me we're not.
Wait! Good morning, Sam. Sam, this is Die Hardman. You were out like a log. Must have been beat. Private rooms come with all the basic amenities. Shower, toilet, etc. Drop in when you need to rest. Inspect your gear, review info, or whatever else. If you have any questions, feel free to ask our staff. But before you do, why not check things out for yourself? See how Bridges operates these days. Sam, Hartman here. Researcher devoted to uncovering the secrets of the beaches and the Death Stranding, as well as those of Dooms and Repatriates. When you relieve yourself, a certain amount of chiral matter is flushed from your system. Chiral matter can adversely affect hormone secretion and nervous function. There's a correlation between exposure and the development of phobias, as well as, in extreme cases, violent and suicidal impulses. Chirelium contamination has even been postulated as a trigger for the onset of dooms. Allow me to collect a sample of your excretions for my studies. They provide a non-invasive means to monitor your exposure to Chirelium. Right, just took a shit and then health. he's collecting it. Great. Thanks, bro. Uh, so we can check on BB, equipment, examine equipment rack, examine weapon rack. Hmm. Hey there. I believe we've met. I oversee delivery operations as well as maintenance and repairs. Nice to have you on board. I'm Mama, in case I didn't mention it before. Those there are strands. Not just used for packing, by the way, but for identification, too. Take a closer look and you'll see. See the red there? That's your blood. This case will remove any chiral matter still clinging to your suit. Uh, speaking of suits, blue is for delivery personnel, red for medical, orange for corpse disposal, and black for security. Hmm. Okay, so there's different color suits for different uh, different jobs, I guess, which is pretty dope. Okay, so the only thing we have here is the sunglasses. He said red was medical, right? One, uh, blue is delivery, black is security, and then orange is corp dis corpse disposal. With that terminal there, you can browse the bridge's database, which has info on a range of subjects. You don't have clearance for everything, but there's still plenty you might find informative. Okay, so we have no active orders. Wait, we could change the... The loudness. I don't think so. No. Sam, this is Deadman. I calibrated your BB based on physiological data we collected from you earlier. 
It's still just a best guess, though. After you take it out for a spin, we can check if you're in sync and tweak the BB sensitivity as needed. We got a little baby, dude. All right. Let's see what they got for us. Well, have you had a chance to think it over? Chalk full of Kyrelium. But safe for you Dooms guys to wear. That's all you'll need to go forth and reconnect the world. To make us whole again. I'm a porter. I don't care about connecting anything. Or making knots. But I'll do what I have to, to help Amelie out. Listen up, Sam. The terminals Amelie's people built in the towns and cities they pass through on their journey west are called knots. The infrastructure's there, but the Cairo network is offline. Right now, it's only capable of transmitting voice communications, sometimes wired, sometimes wireless, and a small amount of data. So, unless the necessary data stored on site, our chirograms won't show up. Emily and the other Bridges members you've seen around the place are grams generated with local data. In case you didn't know. Yeah, I see it. So it looks anyway, way better than what we had. All you gotta do is find the knot, connect your Cupid, and bring chiral communications online. Once you connect it to the terminal, you'll be able to initiate zero-time massive data transmission with the UCA network. And just like that, you'll reconnect us not only to each other, but to our past. All the lost and fragmented junk data will be compiled and restored. Like bringing a dinosaur back to life from a fossil. Four point six billion years of history on Earth. All the wisdom and knowledge we lost since the Death Stranding will be ours again. And that, my friend, is how we'll beat this thing. Once you establish Cairo Communications, generating grams won't be an issue. You'll also be able to use Cairo printers. Won't be long before we're able to send all kinds of things through the wire. Except anything original. Or that's got a soul. Nothing real. Just copies. True. Which is why we'll still need porters like you. Before and after we're made whole, we'll need men in the middle. No rest for the wicked, huh? Yeah, well, idle hands and all that. We'll give you the details at the dispatch terminal. Make sure you check it upstairs. Drop's waiting up there, too. These shoes look like they've done some serious miles. Shall I dispose of them? Wait. Hold on. There's something I want you to look into. My blood seemed to set those things off. Happened more than once. Set them off? How do you mean? I don't know. You took my blood, didn't you? You tell me. All right. I'll see what I can do. Hmm.
take care of him. I promise you. Maybe. Maybe. Looks like we're almost wearing like an exoskeleton. Shit looks dope as hell. So this is the access terminal we have to go to. Our mission is just head west. Sam, this is Die Hartman. Your current objective is to extend the Cairo network from here to Port Knot City. But don't think you can make a beeline straight forward. Signal won't carry that far. To cover the distance, we need to utilize knots. Think of it like uh, tying ropes together to make a longer rope. The first of these knots is a bridge's way station. Go ahead and take a look at the order. Deliver whatever they need and connect the cupid. Too easy, dude. Okay. So. Uh, take orders. Order for Sam. Take on orders. Yep. Uh, smart drug delivery, way station. Sam, order summaries may contain information critical to your success. Make sure to review them before getting underway. Um, about each order, order summaries, risks, objectives for the order, cargo delivery, various information about the cargo. Okay. So they want us to deliver to smart drugs. Uh, order details. So just less than 50% damage. Uh, the focus of the delivery is on the condition of the cargo. So we just got to make sure we don't damage it. And I think the only way you damage it is by falling, right? Uh, smart drugs. And supplies. We got what? A climbing anchor and four ladders. Oh, so I get to pick where I want it? Um, yeah, I guess we just carry it on our back. Sam, we've supplied you with some rope and a ladder for this run. Oh. They should help with the steeper inclines, and the ladder will also make a halfway decent bridge if you need to cross a river. Right now, I figure you're thinking about how you want to handle this order. Oh, wait, 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 wait. So, how you carry your cargo, how to balance your load will affect your ability to walk. Cargo positioning can also be adjusted by... Oh, okay, so the ladders, too, take up, um, take space. Uh, shit. Well, fucking one ladder takes up a whole slot. Okay, so... How many ladders do, do I really want to bring, though? Maybe... Do I have to bring all of them? Oh shit, yeah, you can attach them to your suit too. Look at that. One on our hip there. And do one on our hip there. So I got all five ladders. I 
And then for the climbing anchor, throw that on our back too. Okay, so I got the drugs. We got some extra boots. There it is. Okay, so that was the incinerator. We can go the same route, which once we got over here, it was actually really, really nice. Um, I wonder if I could just avoid these mountain here and uh, just kind of cross the water and we'll go around and stay on the flats here. And then we'll worry about that. So, yeah, we're going to go here. Yeah, we'll go like that. That way I can stay relatively on the flat. Begin and scan. Yeah, you can drive in this turn. game. Just not, I guess, like right, not right off the bat. They make you work for it. You can build roads and all this other shit, too. Sam, triple check your loadout, I take it. Where's my other... Ladder. I thought I had one on my other hip, too. Oh, who the fuck are these guys? Shay, I can hack into this. It shows, uh... That looks good. Here come the troll signs. Sam, even the best porters have been known to lose their cargo. But you're better than the best. You've got what it takes to finish what they started. If you come across any abandoned shipments, consider taking them to their intended destination. It's easier than you might think. See, all our packages are tagged with Bridges IDs for easy tracking. And your Ojo deck is equipped with a scanner which might detect that ID. Which is a roundabout way of saying that that thing on your shoulder can help you locate mislaid shipments. Well, fuck, guys. There's a lot of shit out here. Like, how the hell am I supposed to grab all that? There's four packages literally right here. Remember, Sam. Every parcel is a promise made to a person in need. And they're counting on you to deliver. Yeah, make sure we're heading in the right direction. So we're heading towards B this way. Auto arrange your cargo. Oh, right there. Auto arrange. Your current load will be optimized, allowing you to carry additional cargo on your back. Oh, shit. Now look at it. <laughs> I don't know how much of this shit I should. Just 
just be consistently picking up is it i mean it looks like we're carrying we can we can carry up to 120 pounds Okay, we look a little ridiculous, but hey, it is what it is. You said I don't have to pick up the lost girl. What do you mean? There's no way that you can just not pick it up. It would bother me to just be having these packages here. All right, let's see here. I mean, obviously, I'm gonna I'm gonna run out of uh, carry capacity. Do we do we get money though? Like, if we deliver these packages, do we get like money to buy like weapons and shit? If we deliver these, there's got to be some advantage to delivering these things, right? Gotta watch crossing the damn water, man. Yeah, we get money, see? So then, yeah, boom. There it is, guys. We need money. Okay, so let me uh, auto-organize again. Okay. Oh, what is that? Oh shit, I can deliver lost cargo to this thing? Good work, Sam. I see you brought in some lost cargo. Feel free to submit it here for processing. If you come... It'll be safe and secure until another porter comes along to finish the job. Even if it has to pass through a dozen more hands before it arrives, you can rest easy knowing you did your part. Uh, hell yeah, I picked it up off the ground, dude. We got all these savages in chat that are just leaving it, you know? Uh, so yeah, we'll just trust. I don't. I don't care. Wait, do I not get money if I if I leave it here? Let's see. Cargo has been entrusted to another player. Oh no. I only get likes. Oh wait, we got a little bit of money there, I think. Maybe? I don't know what's money. Damn, I should have delivered that shit myself, guys. Alright, well now we know. Oh, likes are everything? Oh, okay, likes are the money. Okay, good, we're good then. I do have the, the, the online mode off. But now, I guess delivering it ourselves will probably get more instead of entrusting it. Because I'm getting sidetracked. I gotta make sure we're still heading. Yeah, my, my second point was over there. I'm just I'm grabbing all these packages trying to make some money. Sam, 
come up against a sheer cliff or a steep slope, don't forget this about one's the worth 60 likes. You. Be sure to try it out. I'd be interested to see what use as a seasoned pro like you might find for it. Come on, dude. See, I, I plan my route out before I even... We don't even need ladders, guys, because I'm always going to take the route that uh, doesn't require it. I mean, I'm pretty sure you're going to hit some, some areas here that demand the use of ladders, but... Oh, shit. Remember that prolonged exposure to timefall damages cargo containers. Don't stay out in the rain any longer than you have to. Um. Fuck. Well, we gotta find some cover. I don't see any caves or anything, though. What is that? Okay, let me auto arrange this. Our pack is getting kind of big here. I don't see anywhere I can get away from this. Breathe easy, Sam. You're clear of BG territory. Okay, good. The rain the stopped. Stranding's to blame for all of this. The gazers, the fall of America, everything. It warped the world beyond recognition. Humanity had to scramble like rats fleeing a sinking ship. But there's nowhere else to go. There's no future living like this. If we're to survive, we to find another way, a way to overcome the BTs, the Death Stranding, the whole damn mess. So I can wait out the rain here, right? There is no leftovers left, though. I ate them all. There we go.
think that's the spot right there. Yeah, I ate all the rest of the beef stew and the meatballs are all gone. It's all good. I'll just order some. It's fine. Ooh, look at that big package right there. Whoa, this one's worth 200 likes. Guys, there's no way. You're telling me that people literally just walk past. Like, I just had the urge to pick this shit up. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Okay, we're almost at max capacity, though. <laughs> oh, we look ridiculous. Oh, okay. We gotta watch that. Um, so how do I use the ladders, then? Oh, we fucked up, guys. I might have made a mistake. Sam, a well-placed ladder can get you safely across most rivers, you know. Maybe try using the one we issued you. Okay, how do I how do I do that? Uh, hold one to ready the ladder. Yep, here we go. Boom. Got the ladder out. Ha! There it is. Yeah, Prime. Yeah. Let me see them likes on that ladder, baby. Hey, 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 hey. Should I pick my ladder back up, though? I don't want to have to like buy new ones, so. I'm... So, so get my ladder back, dude. Wait, where is it? Oh, fuck, if you don't get it back, I should have just left it there. Bruh. I just, I just erased that lat poor guy who's coming behind me, who... <laughs> My bad! Too close. Okay, so that's our location, right? Yep. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead, get another ladder here. Uh, kind of doesn't seem long enough. Uh, right, right there might be okay. Yo, how crazy does the terrain get in this game? See, the problem is, though, if I, if I turn on the online stuff, Caspi, there's going to be people who have all left all the shit around, you know what I mean? And then I'll, I won't have to u figure it out myself. I'll just be able to use what everybody else left, you know? We made it, though. <laughs> Look at all the... <laughs> Look at this shit, dude. <laughs> We're ridiculous looking. Cargo Thank you. No, because you'll be out of the network at first. We'll see. We'll 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 see. We'll see. I uh will make that delivery.
I wonder what smart drugs are. Cargo. Scotland with the super chat. Thank you so Thank much, you. man. We've all been feeling the loss of Central Knot City. No one seemed to know what it meant for the organization. Or the UCA. Or us. But the oxytocin will take the edge off and that'll be a big help. Won't be long before we're back on track. We may have a look. <laughs> this is great. Thank you again. Yeah, everything looks to be in good order. There it is. And soon our way station will be too, I hope. Yeah. I kept that out of the rain for you, bro. We're getting that fucking mailman of the year award, boy. See, guys, who would have... And I thought being a mailman was going to be a bad thing. Like, because that, that, that's what I was talking with Caspi about. Um, if a game is a walking simulator, they got to make the walking interesting. You know what I mean? But, so, the fact that the terrain... It's like obstacles, you know what I mean? You actually got to, and I'm pretty sure you know, use tools and shit like that and then figure out what to carry. When not. They're doing a good job, you know what I mean? This is, this is okay. I can, I can walk and simulate this. This is my type of walking simulator. You're with the second team, right? Where are the others? Dead. Caught in the void out. It, and the game has combat, no yes, guys. That one uh, well, that's what I've heard. Caspi says and there's what, guns and, you out on your own? and shit, so we'll I see. Mean, if it was just a delivery, that'd be one thing. Porters come through from time to time, but the second team was meant to bring the Cupid. They were going to connect us up. Three years we've been waiting for help. Three years. And they sent us one guy who was... Shit, shit, shit. Tell me you brought more than the Oxy, at least. I've got the Cupid. You... There it is. So it's true. I finally got it working. Well, then you just might be the answer to my prayers. So, what are you waiting for? But you, you put us on the goddamn grid. Then why do you break it off like that? Okay. Uh, new option has been uh, we can fabricate equipment, make deliveries, share. Look, okay. Connection to capital, not city confirmed. It's really happening. <laughs> Just like Amelie promised, we can finally do what we came here to do. Hey, um, you're headed west, right? Gonna be a lot of people happy to see you. Guess you'll keep on until you hit the coast, huh? Which means you'll get to see Amelie in person. Oh, that's something. That is really something. I Me, I've never met her. Only seen her hollow messages back when I was with the first expedition. Well, anyway, you best be careful on the road. There's some bad people. Dude, can you shut there. the fuck up so I can get this stuff off my back? Say. But I don't need to Gotta sustain standing here with all this stuff on. There it is. Thank you, Sam. By bringing that way station into the Cairo network, you've put it in direct contact with those of us back here in Capital Knot City. Right. Yeah, What's just give next? me the two McChicken with extra mayo and fry. West of the way station are a couple of structures our previous expedition put in place. And beyond them is your next destination, Port Knot City. It's on the shore of a crater lake that formed after the first void out. Your objective is to link up port and capital knot. But to do that, you'll need to utilize our facilities as additional waypoints. They'll be essential for establishing a stable connection. Okay. Given the distance we need to cover, we're looking at using a distribution center and a power station. As to which you should head for first, start with the distro center. We've got some cargo that needs delivering anyway. Check the nearby delivery terminal to pick it up. Nah, guys, because then you got to take... Listen, listen, listen. So you take the McChicken, right? You got to take the, the the bun off. You get the... Because that's the lettuce, the extra mayo, right? You take the French fries, right? You put the French fries on the sandwich, okay? Then I got some Frank's Red Hot in the, in the, in the, in the fridge, 
right? You splash some hot sauce, a bunch of hot sauce on that, then you smush it together, right? Until the hot sauce mayo combination squeezing out the side, and then that's how you eat it. Yep, yeah, there it is. Okay. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. New order available. Please access delivery. Your hard work's paying off, Sam. Thanks to the increase in network capacity, HQ is now in a position to provide you with additional materials and support. Okay. Should prove useful. Okay, HQ. Let's see. Um, can I get a gun? No. No gun. Just more ladders and Sam, anchors. You can use that PCC to build a post box. I guess that would be nice if uh if I'm out and I got a back full of shit and I really don't want to deliver it all. Scotland with this super chat, you can't explain yourself. No, dude. It's delish. Special agent with the super chat, brother. I appreciate it, man. Uh, this for your McDonald's enjoy. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much, man. It's so kind of you. McDouble, uh, add the McChicken patty in between. What, what is that's isn't that called like a McNasty or something? It's like an actual name. Uh, I know they actually have a menu where you can like order all those. This is for your McDonald's. <laughs> enjoy. Okay, so I think I. I'm going to buy... Well, right now, I don't know. I was, I was thinking about maybe cutting down on the amount of ladders I have and getting um, getting my hands on maybe some of these. So we'll do two... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll do two anchors, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And... And then we'll do one of these PCs, C's, PCCs. Uh, I don't need any more ladders, though. I got tons of ladders. Okay. Oh. Um. Okay, and then we'll attach the other one to the suit. Or to our back, never mind. I'm about to reorganize all this shit here in a sec. Okay, so make deliveries, deliver lost cargo. Yep, there it is. Grant <laughs> Walker said extra mayo is McNasty. <laughs> there it is, dude. Um, so what do we end up with? Shit, I thought the one was worth 200 likes by itself. Guess that's not how it works. Uh, the poor boy will learn in a basic order. By the time of ever, one day you'll be recognized as a true legend. There it is. Okay, so now let's look at our body. I'm going to go ahead and auto-arrange. Okay, so I think maybe we could drop some of the... How many ladders do I have on me? So I have... Okay, so we, we, we don't need all these. Let me see. Can I store this? I think this said private storage somewhere, right? Uh, private locker. Here we go. Your private locker can be used. Yeah, I know. You don't have to explain to me, dude. Okay, so I will go ahead. I'll put this extra anchor in my locker. All right, and then I'll keep. Yeah, we'll keep the two ladders, two anchors. I feel like that's. And then we got a PC PCC here. Oh, so we got to make sure we're paying attention to the condition of our boots. So uh, right now, these boots are 
12% damage. We got an extra pair, so yeah, I guess I have an extra pair of boots on you is legit. Alright, there we go. So we stored that up. Let's see what they have here. Orders for Sam. Uh, rare metal delivery. And... They want me to construct a post box. Oh shit, number of delivery six. I'll deliver all six containers of rare metal. Oh jeez. Um I don't know if I wanna should we backtrack first and just build this yeah, you know what? No, 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 hold on, hold on. So what I'll do is we'll we'll construct this post box real quick. Uh because I could just run over there really quick, you know what I mean? Post box, you'll need to use a PCC. It goes without saying, but if yep. so, I because I could just run over there really quick like this. If I grab those medals and shit, I'll have I'll be carrying a lot. Order. Head to the site I designated and build that post box, would you? You should have no trouble finding it if you check your map and compass from time to time. Okay. Yeah, so I figured it'd be easier if we just do it like this. No no gear on us. We can just run over here, drop the post box down. Then we'll come back, grab all that metal. So I think it was said it was six containers. So, And I want to thank you guys for almost 600 likes on the stream. That's absolutely insane. Water. Well, we might have some BTs. Okay. Use it to build a post box within the area I specified. Someone will eventually come along who could use it. If you've got enough supplies, why not leave some behind? Do right by others, they'll do right by you. What do you mean, dude? I don't I don't have enough supplies. Donate Sam, weapons and equipment. You can use share lockers to exchange cargo with other porters. Okay. I ain't got it, guys. Just I'm not trying to be stingy, I just ain't got it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Over drummer, how you doing today, brother? No, it, so I it, uh, I'll show you what I mean, Cash. So the online is on. Um but there's cert like I'll show you right here. Uh options, game settings. So I have it so it hides spoilers to hide for the signs or whatever. Um, BT and counter warning. I don't here it is shared content. So um, I can have share everything, which is uh, specify what is share. If you undo share, so I have share. Don't share structures. 
signs or vehicles. So anything other than structure, signs, or vehicles is still shared. Because I didn't know. I don't that that sounded OP. So I just turned that off. All right, so let's head back. Yeah, that makes everything shareable. And I Fuck, come on. Uh, Cerebral, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. All right, so now let's go get the... So when you sprint like that too, it does more damage to your boots. Let's get this order. Six items we're gonna have to deliver here. Uh, we're good on that stuff. So we auto arrange that. Uh, Said, thank you for the sub. Order assigned. All right. So let's let's get our map up. Uh, so we got to come down to the dis distribution center here. Um, honestly, we'll, we'll cross the water here. And it looks like if we stay out, because this side of the water, as you guys can see, there's a huge uh, elevation here. So that's going to be a mess. So I, if, but it looks like if we stay on this side of the water, it seems relatively flat the whole entire way down. So yeah, we'll just go across there. Let me see. Can I clear these off? Yeah, we'll just come out the back side here, we'll cross the water here, and then yeah, we'll just follow down this way. Have any weapons, bro? Yo, it seems like we got a lot of mayo haters in the chat. Oh, there it is, guys. Mayo is legitimately one of my favorite condiments of all time. I don't know if I should jump down this. I mean, I could use one of them anchors, right? Or we could set up a ladder. Well, the only reason why I said extra mayo is because the McDonald's where we live, they 
barely put any mayo on there. Like it, it's it's pretty bad. So I asked for extra mayo to just get a normal amount of mayo. So I was gonna cross here, but as you guys can see, um, what is that? By what? Move now before someone has eyes on you. Bro, what are you get fucking? To your destination ASAP if you don't want to get caught. Fuck! What's happening, guys? Shit! I was gonna cross over there, but I don't know who those guys are. But they pinged me. Cross here, we should be should be okay. Starting to get tired, man. All right, uh, I think we got. I believe the location that we need to go to is right down there. Yep. So we got time fall right now, but no BTs, it seems. I could actually go wait in this little crevice up here for the rain to stop. Protect our gear. Uh, yellow takes more stamina and red. You'll f actually fall in. Okay. So we're just waiting out the time fall. I don't know how long this shit can last. It starts lasting too long. We might just have to say screw it and go. Oh, sometimes the, the rain will not stop. I'm not bored. I've been playing. We've been playing, what, for three hours already? I'm not bored at all playing this game. I can't say the same thing for you guys watching it. You know what I mean? Watching. There's some games that are, you know, pretty fun to watch. Uh, and some games that are, and you know, oh, let me rephrase that. There's some games that are funner to play than they are to watch. And then there's vice versa. Some games are better to watch than they are to play. Um, I'm, I've been having a great time with this game. OK, 
Okay, so we're almost there. We gotta figure. So there are bad guys, as you guys just seen. We got chased by. They were called mules. We don't have a weapon or anything to defend ourselves, but I'm sure, you're pretty sure the game should hook us up with something here soon, right? <laughs> I think we're good. Something wrong, Sam? I don't know. Kid doesn't look so hot. Uh, nothing to worry about. Its functions are temporarily suspended, but they can be restored. I can perform the necessary maintenance at a distribution center. Hurry, though. From autotoxemia? Wait, but now I don't know where the BTs are. When the strain on your BB exceeds sustainable levels, it triggers the production of harmful compounds, and the body, in essence, begins to attack itself. It's called autotoxemia. If your BB's not performing the spec, drop by your private room and see if the incubator helps. Is there a way to turn the BB off? That way he doesn't fucking die? Ah, uh, Scott, thank you for the sub, man. I appreciate it. Oh! Is that a vehicle? Uh, Sam? Seems like that bike's auto-charging unit is busted. If you want to take it for a spin, you'll need to use a generator to give it some juice. Beginning scan. Okay, how do we how do we get a generator? Verifying ID. It's clear. All weapons will remain on until the Cargo verified. Thank you. Contaminating suit. Rest is advised. We need some new boots here.
But he's not out making deliveries. So what'd you bring us? Let's see it. Talk about above and beyond. <laughs> Thanks. Must have had to pass through BT territory to get here too, didn't you? Too easy, dude. <laughs> they weren't joking when they said you were a legend. So we got 595 likes from that. Okay, it's time. Do you mind connecting us to the network? Like levitating, you know what I mean? Siggy. The landscape is built from scans of Icelandic landscape, including textures and terrain. If you're ever on your way to mainland Europe with a layover in Iceland, I'll give you a death stranding tour winking face. <laughs> Siggy, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. And thank you for the super chat, It really means a lot. That's dope, man. Sam, as always, thanks for bringing more folks into the UCA. Okay, so new uh, interview data acquired meals and mules and drone syndrome bridge babies time fall. Looks like we're on the chiral network, and with those materials you brought for our chiral printer, we can produce supplies for you here as needed. Think of it as our way of returning the favor. Now head west and keep on doing what you do. Good. The distro center is on the network. Sam, do me a favor. Take your BB to a private room and connect it to the incubator. Good work. Rest in private room. So I got I guess we got to look at um Building a generator. I don't know what that's going to require, but I don't even know if that's something that we can do right now. So it seems like the longer you're out, and the more you hey man, put your you BB through. Help. Okay, Sam. Remove the pod and connect it to that incubator. Through the stressful situations that they they need to be recharged, or you will be without your baby. It's in. Good. Uh, a temporary excess of stress. Easily addressed if we return it to its mother's womb. Mother? Uh, located in the capital not city, ICU. Brain dead, of course. Ah, uh, you mean still mother? Correct. A still mother's womb facilitates a connection between the world of the dead and the BB. And you, in turn, connect yourself to a BB granting you the ability to sense BTs. These pods were designed to simulate the conditions inside a still mother's womb. BBs need to believe they're in one at all times to function properly. However, we can only maintain this deception for so long, which is why we must periodically update the environmental data by synchronizing it with a steel mother via the chiral network. There. The update is in progress. Right now the pod is synchronizing with the steel mother in Capital Knot City and reconfiguring its settings based on the latest data. Returning your BB to the womb in this manner will temporarily reduce its stress levels. That being where it technically belongs, of course. Kid looks happy. I'll try adjusting the oxytocin dosage. 
Autotoxemia should set in much slower from now on. <sighs> You should remember that BBs are just equipment. Try not to get attached. Well, don't tell me how to Each live my one fucking has life. Been physically removed from its steel mother's womb. A process that renders them unpredictable and prone to failure. No BB on record has remained in service for over a year. Uh, it may need to be retired before this expedition is over. Mm. And then. You're saying there's no way to keep my BB alive? Uh, you must understand. There is still a great deal we don't know about BBs. As we expand the chiral network and recover more past data, perhaps we'll find our answers. Uh, oh, right. You asked me to look into why the BTs might be reacting to your blood. I spoke with Hartman. We should have your results soon. Anyway, get some rest. You and your BB are both exhausted. <sighs> Good night, Sam. Right they over here just trying to kill my baby, dude. It ain't happening. Not happening. I ain't nowhere to sleep, bro. Man, you ain't even sleeping with a pillow, no blankets. That's how savages sleep right there on top of the blankets, dude. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. Sam? Why she gotta be so fucking weird about it, dude? Can you see me? How are things over there? Still not under guard. Still not chained up. Still can't leave. But if you can keep making connections, if you can get to me, we can go back east. Back home. Thank you. I mean that. <sighs> it's bad. The graphics in this game are pretty are fucking fewer crazy. There are fewer people in the cities these days. No one's having children anymore. But humans aren't made for living alone. They're supposed to come together. To help one another. And if we as a people can't do that, if we can't reconnect, then, well... It's like Bridget said, extinction. Come on. Rebuilding America isn't going to get rid of the BTs. As long as they're still around, there's no escaping it. But at least we'll have hope. I'll be waiting, Sam. Waiting for you. Come and find me. Hello, Sam. This is Hartman. Since you're awake, it might behoove you to freshen up. To that end, why not take a shower? But we don't take it's showers around here, so. bro. And also my research as it happens. Did you ever have 
study other people with dooms? Everyone is riches, myself and Mama. Results thus far are inconclusive. But you possess other singular qualities, being a repatriate as well. I must confess to a measure of optimism. Processing fluids, waste products, chirally, dispensing. There, take the sample with you. Should the opportunity arise, try using it on a BT. I'm curious to see how they react. So we got a weapon against you BTs know, now? It may even prove beneficial to you. There was an old research paper detailing the effects of bodily fluids from individuals like us on BTs. It is only by recovering these materials that we can unearth the knowledge of the past. Not just the death stranding, but also the mystery of your body's unique properties and even our doom's affliction. There may well be hope for humanity. Sam, I have no interest in rebuilding America. I want to recover the past. Five, oh, four, it's almost three, time. Two, one. After you make your connections and nothing happens, then what? I said, then what? Fuck me, right? Sam, sorry to bother you while you're taking a break, but I figured you'd want to hear this. Hell, maybe it'll help you rest easier. We received a number of messages addressed to you. I've not taken a look myself, but I gather they're mostly from your clients. You should see if they contain any useful information. Mail can be accessed via your cufflinks, as well as the terminal in your private room. There's something else I'd like to share with you. With the Cairo network, we now have the power to reclaim our past. Data once thought lost forever from every corner of America can be pieced back together from fragmented records. Our archives are still a work in progress, of course. But as we expand the network and integrate more way stations and cities, we'll be able to recover more and more information, such as the previous expedition's logs and reports. Everything they sent back was lost when Central Knot City was destroyed. Now, we've managed to restore some already, in fact. You can access them from a private room terminal or your cufflinks by selecting Archives. Might make for interesting reading. There we go. Look, can I check on the baby, dude? Tired, huh? Okay, here we go. Let's activate the terminal. Uh, take on a new order from the distribution center. Now I think we gotta head up to the power station. I forgot to tell you. It's about managing Scotland, the stress hanging out. levels and reducing the risk of autotoxemic attacks. There are a few things you can do if your BB starts showing signs of distress. Such as? Such as take a moment to look after it. Cradle the pot, gently rock it, that sort of thing. Out of curiosity, how's it doing at the moment? Uh, 
before I answer that... Something wrong? When I hook up my BB, I see things. What kind of things? Like a face, someone I don't know, calling to me. There's this room, too, with other people talking, but I can't make out the words. Hmm, bleed-through effect. Didn't I warn you about this? You're mistaking the BB's memories for your own. They're false flashbacks, nothing more. Let me explain. A BB is harvested from its steel mother at around 28 weeks and placed in a pod. To be clear, this is before it's even born. Harvested, guys. The procedure guys. halts its development. But even at 28 weeks, its sensory systems have matured enough to process external stimuli. It is more than capable of encoding this information into memories, which can bleed into yours via your connection. So who's the man I saw? Someone from the medical team, maybe? Or a BB technician? Does it matter? The BB has been in circulation for a while now. It's been handled by a lot of people. How should I know which one made an impression? Because you're the expert. No one's an expert, Sam. BBs were developed decades ago in secret. They're your quintessential black boxes. We may use them, but we don't truly understand them. Believe me, I've been trying to learn more, but almost all of the old records are gone. If I find anything out, I'll tell you, all right? Dead man's honor. <laughs> Mr. Morgan, first of all, you got those you got those figures way off, brother. I have uh, sixty thousand subscribers, uh, not sixty thousand um, members. Uh, you could you could dial that sixty thousand down to about four or five hundred members at any given time. Uh, that's about what I'm sitting at. Yeah, subscribers and channel members are two different things. If I had sixty thousand members, yeah, that would be a, a, a way different story. But no. I got like four to five hundred at any given time. <laughs> mm. was... That ice cream is good, guys. While you're resting, I ran some network diagnostics. Corellian monitoring and holographic systems are nominal. Unfortunately, our printer is offline. I know, I know. After all the <laughs> yeah, could you to imagine, guys? Sixty thousand members. This one's on us. We Jesus ordered a part Christ. a while back, but it never arrived. The printer needs it to communicate with the chiral network. Mules must have snatched it, caught that porter en route, or something. If I'm right, they'll have taken it to their drop site, which is smack dab in the middle of their territory. Don't suppose you'd be up for stealing us our property back? Can't think of anyone more qualified than you. Let's do it, dude. This sounds a little sketch, though. So, recover chiral printer interface. Let me see. So, I can check. <laughs> it cast me if I had 60,000 bro <laughs> you definitely get a bonus dude all right so let's see here uh cargo condition 50% uh, uh recover from the mule camp watch out for mules the cargo must be recovered from one of their camps um the only thing is is aren't they gonna fuck me up when I go to their camp maybe they give us a weapon now a device that is used to connect the printer, okay. Or maybe maybe we gotta be like stealthy, you know what I mean? George with the five gifted members, brother. Holy shit, thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate that, man. And everybody who receives one of the memberships, hey, welcome to the family. Um, and then this says collect. Chiral crystals. At least one CG of chiral crystals. Okay, yeah, we see them all over the place, so we can grab those. Mama's added a watchtower schematic to your PCC. 
If you don't have it on you, consider fabricating one. You never know when you'll need to recon an area. Hmm. So we'll hang it on our tool rack. Why do I have more than one? Why are they giving me so many, dude? I don't I don't need that many. Crystal collector. Now, as the name suggests, it provides secure storage for any crystals you gather. Uh, 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 allow me to describe your quarry. Chiral crystals appear gold to the naked eye and are frequently found in formations resembling human handprints. The surrounding rocks and debris tend to float a few feet above the ground. And they are most commonly found in areas with high precipitation. Got all that? Hmm? Rain, floating rocks, golden handprints. That's your trifecta. Seen Look tons of these them. These three things, and you'll find the crystals. If you've been especially observant, then perhaps you already know where to look. Already, I mean, I don't remember ex exactly where they are, but let's do this. <laughs> Have a pleasant journey. Oh, wait, 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 wait. So... Looks like you've got an empty container there, huh? Feel free to submit junk like that to Bridges. You might not have a use for it, but we do. Oh, shit. So, when it comes to building a generator, I wonder how I, uh, orders, mail, data, systems, will, uh, will they tell me about that, like, that type of shit later on? Because I don't think I could do that type of stuff right now, right? Okay, so I believe that's where we need to go. Nope, that's... Not the way we need to go. Let's uh erase all these old markers. Okay. And then the crystals are up here in this area. Uh yeah, we can go grab the crystals real quick, it's fine. Weapons restrictions. I actually lifted. see right some right here. Sam, Cairo crystals are pretty small and can be difficult to spot with the naked eye. I'd advise you to use your ultra deck to point you in the right direction. If you want to survey a wider area, though, you might consider building a watchtower and relying on its sensors. This shit's pretty easy to see, dude. When there's the floats. Beginning scan. Different from usual. The process is pretty simple though. Access the delivery terminal to drop off any Cairo crystals you're carrying. Decontaminating suit. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. So do we recycle the Cairo crystals? I don't I don't get it. Can we recycle yep, okay, yep, yeah, can be recycled. So yeah, we recycle them.
Got some chiral crystals for us? These crystals only form in places with elevated chirillium levels. Which makes me wonder if expanding the network had something to do with it. Not a bad haul. That dude's armor looks sick Quite as hell. For research. We'll take good care of it. Excess chiral crystals can be deposited at any facility. They'll be added to the stores held on site. These Good work, Sam. It seems your connection level is increasing. As your connection level increases, larger quantities of resources will be made available to you at our facilities. So can I bridge guards? Skilled handler, um, delivery volume, grade 10. You can now carry more cargo. spray for patching up cargo containers good for dealing with time fall degradation and all that useful stuff if you and your cargo have been through the ringer we've added it to your supplies list so it's readily available if and when you need it okay that's nice so then we don't have to super worry about waiting out the rain Uh, yeah, we'll carry on our back button. Let me, uh, confirm this. I'm going to store some shit because I feel like we got a lot of gear on that we don't need. There is a correlation between elevated Corellian levels and increased crystal formation. This may well be the result of the network's expansion. You needn't worry, though. Local chiral density is still within an acceptable range. If you find any more, be sure to collect it. You'll be well rewarded. If you come into more chiral crystals, you can submit them at one of our facilities. And you can deposit other resources too, along with any items you don't need. Everything has its value. What we don't use as is can be broken down into components for R&D and other applications. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead. Oh, what is this? EX grenades? Oh, that's for the, uh, that's our, that's our piss grenades, right? All right, um, we'll store this. Got our extra boots. Um, store this. I'm gonna store this. Carry one of everything right now. I feel like we, I feel like I was just too bulked up. Like, wicked bulked up for no reason. Okay, so then we got one anchor. We got a repair spray, a ladder, PCC, and boots. I don't know why that was on the ground. Oh, 
Here we go. All right, so now we got to sneak into this bad guy camp. This is where things are going to get interesting, because I don't know how to... Still got work to do, Sam. We just got to be sneaky. Let's not keep people waiting. I think we can just head up this way. Web beginning scan. Weapons restrictions lifted. Call it a rule or a habit, but most mules almost always bring stolen shipments home with them. Find the post box, steal back the cargo. Simple as that. But okay. be careful. These guys are armed. If this goes sideways, be ready to fight. With what? Um, so I can attack. Oh, shit. So this whole time we had hands, guys, and I didn't even know? Forever Gaming, thank you for this sub, man. I appreciate it. I wonder if I can uh, change the key bindings, though, because E is for carry on back, F is for dismount vehicle. Okay, so attack. I'm going to change that button to this. Okay. Because ain't nobody sitting here trying to push fucking V, dude. You know, I could set up a ladder here. I make my life a little easier. Why y'all gotta do me like that? Why the fucking ladder gotta be so tall, dude? Remember, Sam, before you approach the mule drop site, we recommend you use a watchtower to confirm the location of the post box containing our cargo. So is it in the in the cave or above it? Mule drop sites are rarely deserted, so remaining undetected is key. Keep a low profile and move slow. I see one of them over there. Noise. Was heavy. <clears throat> okay, so I believe I seen one of the guys walking around out here. I wanted to get that watchtower up. Yep, there's a the campsite. So let's head up on top of the mountain here. That way we can set up that watchtower. I can get a good overview of the site. How are you doing, Josh?
No, 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 no. It's okay, bro. Shh. It's not soothing him, dude. This is why is he shaking so fucking hard, bro? <laughs> oh, you're supposed to do it soft, okay. I was doing it too hard, guys. I didn't know, guys. I was just fucking shaking it, dude. <laughs> I was just shaking it. <laughs> Alright, so make sure you guys don't shake the fucking the baby, okay? We busted our ass, like, hard. Uh, so hold two to select structures. I want a watchtower. Lorenzo, I'm actually liking this game quite a bit, man. Construction complete. Thank you for the super chat. All right, so let's see if this watchtower will give us the eyes that we want to see. So that's what we want right there, right? Okay, awesome. So we've located it. Now we just gotta try to get in there all sneaky like. I wonder if there's like a stealth takedown, like if I sneak up behind people. Can I just like one shot them? This guy doesn't fucking know that we're a ghost, guys. Equip the strand? How the hell do you do that? Urinate? Can be used to bind human enemies from behind and to parry attacks at close quarters. Get fucked. 
Okay. <clears throat> Damn, there's a lot of shit in here, dude. So this is... We need this. Okay, this is obviously part of the, the mission. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we could take a bunch of this shit. Um, probably use... I, I took the boots because, you know... Obviously, we're going to have to keep changing. Your boots actually wear down over time. We'll grab that. Think about grabbing these metals, too. You know what I mean? Let's see if we can reconfigure this. Okay. What else? Can, uh, I don't want to go too heavy, just in case I gotta, I gotta battle some dudes. You know what I mean? that oh grant don't even don't, yeah whoever that test dude is don't don't pay him no mind brother like yeah he's just talking out of his ass because he doesn't know what the hell he's talking about botting views <laughs> if i was botting views don't you think i bought more than uh i bought a shit ton of them See, we fucked up. We're super heavy, but there's nobody else here, so... Well, there might be, but nobody we have to worry about, at least. Yeah, I was like, you know, when I... I'd buy, I'd buy a couple thousand, you know what I mean? Even though I don't even know how, like... I don't even think botting views is a thing anymore, guys. Especially on YouTube, they... You would definitely get banned. I, there is not a post box nearby, but there is the uh, watchtower I just built. This train is shit, man. Um, maybe we could do a, uh, let's say maybe we could do an anchor. Uh, 
Yeah, I think maybe we could do an anchor. We actually had quite a bit of rope there, like 30 meters of rope. No, guy. Listen, listen, guys. It, it, it's just like this. When when somebody sees something they don't understand, or you know, maybe Test was a streamer, or is trying to be a streamer, or something like that, you know, and he streams and 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 doesn't get many viewers or whatever, whatever, whatever the case may be. But when people see something they don't understand, they automatically look at the person that's doing it and they're like, "Oh, well, you're cheating somehow," or you know what I mean. This can't be real. That that's what people think, and I mean, it is what it is, bro. Like he, you know, he could think whatever he wants to think. I don't have to fucking defend myself to him. But you know, uh, you know the, the the I do appreciate you guys. Almost 750 likes on the stream, and if if all you know 600 plus of you guys want to say type in the chat for for uh for test just type high test uh so you can see all of our, our our talking bots you know i got that new software guys i have bots that become channel members uh you know they uh <laughs> they become channel members they hit the like button it's the most advanced botting system you have ever seen test there it is brother <laughs> there it is And then we got a lot of lurkers in the chat. We got a lot of lurkers. If the lurkers want to come out and let and say hi to test, you know, all, all of all of our talking bots. Here it is. Look at it. There it is. <laughs> You're fucking. There it is, bro. <laughs> yeah. It's, see how advanced my botting software is, bro? I can, I, I can make it talk on command, dude. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Almost there. Yeah, I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm controlling. I'm controlling the bot. What you guys don't understand is, my bot controller is hidden at the bottom of this McFlurry container. So that's why you know I had to dig around in the bottom of the McFlurry container in order to get the bot to do what I needed it to do. It's a secret. I'm, I can't let you guys in on it. But yeah, you know, there it is. There it is. But just so you know, the secret lies within the bottom of your fucking McFlurry. <laughs> he says McFlurry, but it's actually a cup of mayo. Ugh. I like mayo, man. Not that much, though. That would be... I was like, what is that noise? Am I 
Am I armed? Not yet. Uh, we we just figured out that we can punch shit, though. We did find out that we can punch stuff. Scanning bridges, ID. Verifying ID. Please close all weapons and remain armed until puncture. Cargo verified. Thank you. Decontaminating suit. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Yeah, he's probably not gonna say anything back, guys. That's uh, that's generally how how it is. You know, people when they get proved wrong, they don't they don't like to stick around. They just go hide back in their hole. All right, so let's go ahead, make delivery. So we didn't have to fight anybody. We actually got to stealth kill people, though, which was dope. Uh, well, we didn't kill them because technically if you... So... Hmm. What happens if you kill somebody, like one of them dudes, will they turn into fucking BTs? Could you imagine that, guys? So advanced, your boss pay you. <laughs> and Simon with the super chat. I appreciate that, man. Yeah. I got them super advanced bots, man. Because that would totally make you not want to kill people. Never doubted you'd come through for us. It is. Sam, how are your shoes holding up? Not too well, I imagine, conditions being what they are out there. Nothing ruins your day like shoes falling apart while you're on the job. Carry on like that, and it's only a matter of time before you injure yourself. I've arranged for boots to be added to your supplies. Bridges standard issue, so they ought to fit you fine. What about you a should gun? Always carry an extra pair. But if you forget or run into trouble, you can fabricate another via a terminal at one of our many facilities. Okay, so now I can correct. Oh, you know, the PCC turns into a lot of shit. So those PCCs are pretty useful to have. I can now build an actual bridge with it. I love all the lurkers, all, all the lurkers in the chat. You know, they, they come out when, they, you know, they flex on people. Now they show mega love, and I, I appreciate every single one of you guys. It really does mean the world to me. Well, that now, now I just thought of that. You know what I mean? When you kill things in this game or people die... They turn into B they turn into BTs. So now I'm sitting here thinking like shit. If I end up shooting somebody and killing them, are they gonna turn into a B yeah, like that that's legit. Congratulations, Sam. I understand you now have access to a Cairo printer. An extraordinarily useful device that can only function because of the manner in which our network utilizes the beach, enabling us to transfer massive volumes of data instantaneously. Since, under normal circumstances, such transfers would take hours, if not days, some have speculated that the chiral network might, in essence, be a time machine. That it is transmitting data into the past. Suffice it to say, we have yet to fully grasp the fundamental nature of the network and the beach which we have come to rely on. One might liken our relationship with it to that of primitive man's with fire. Is it useful? Quite. Is it dangerous? Undeniably so. Nevertheless, we have decided that the reward outweighs the risk. Furthermore, as the BTs are linked to the beach, it stands to reason that further study and experimentation... Whoa. Vic, brother, that is way too much, man. My late bot payment from last <laughs> week. Dude, thank you so much. That is a huge super chat. 
Well, Vic just made up for our demonetization, guys. No, I really appreciate that, brother. That is humongous. You did not have to do that, bro. Let's get some hearts in the chat. Vic, how you been, by the way, man? A busy couple weeks. I really appreciate it, brother. The same could be said regarding you, of course. <laughs> Rest assured, I will keep you apprised of what I learn. You have my word. Seriously, dude, that is huge, man. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. I appreciate that, brother. Been lurking in the chat, hey, man. That's all that matters, dude. Hope you're enjoying everything. Oh, we got to deliver these two. Uh... So I got to recycle these, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Recycle these. Uh, recycle. Then recycle. So that gives us more resources to, like, build shit with, right? Climb an anchor. Cargo to recycle. Okay. <laughs> Make out. You've got the most advanced bots on YouTube. Hey, I told you guys. Find them right here. Thank you for your continued support. Okay. Okay, so power supply unit delivery. Um, construction. They want me to build a bridge. And... Uh, collection cargo discovered in, whoa, what does that say? Gun, I see Mazer gun recommended. Okay. How do I, how do I get that? Yeah, that, that I rec, I recommend that same thing. I recommend me getting that right now. Um, fabricate equipment, maybe. We've added a bridge schematic to your PCC. The first step is laying the foundation after which you'll have to supply additional materials to finish the job. Plenty of rivers and canyons could do with a good bridge, you know. Take a stroll across one you built yourself, and I guarantee you'll be glad you made the effort. Give it a try. 800 metal? That's so expensive. Okay, so we can build a bridge. I can do that. Um... Grab this, and then power supply unit delivered to the wind farm. So this is the next area we have to go to anyways. Now, this one I can't do yet because it says that I, uh, Mazer gun recommended. I don't, I don't know what that means. <laughs> Here's a small donation from bot hash 1617. There it is. Z, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. <laughs> uh, what are we playing next? I, I I don't know. It was between it, it's it's between two games. I'm still thinking on it, guys. I'm still thinking on it. I didn't know if I was gonna um I was because I, I I was gonna do stated K one because we probably only got I I could probably finish it tonight. So we'll see. Okay, so we got the uh the wind farm. We'll probably head up. We'll do these two. I'm gonna make this bridge across this water here. Okay, so power unit supply, we gotta... Oh, uh, yeah, we'll throw it on our back. That's fine. Uh, the metals. What do we need the metals for? Oh, this is for the bridge, isn't it? We need that many metals to, for the... Just starting the bridge? Yeah, I know. You guys got disrespected today. All of you guys got called bots. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Uh, we'll store these in our private locker. These ex those extra mule boots. Uh, climb an anchor, container repair. We got a ladder. Yeah, okay. So I think we're good. Screwed. Thanks for playing my favorite walking simulator. Hey, Heart. I really appreciate that. Is a huge super tap, brother. Holy crap, man! Beginning scan. Out of Showing out with the heroes, right? <laughs> Thank you so much, F. Crude. I really appreciate that. I'm hoping okay, you're enjoying man. it. Make your way to the designated construction area for the bridge. The foundation should already be in place. With your help, we'll have the thing finished in no time. There should be a terminal nearby. I see Access it. it to submit additional materials. Weapons restrictions lifted. Holy shit, man. Hey, let's get some hearts in the check, guys. F crude out here showing mega love. Okay, yeah, so I brought ooh, I brought the medals. I I I I think they're for, they're for this. Sam. Looks like we found the site. Should be a terminal nearby. Access it to submit the complete structure. Submit the material the materials required. Boom boom. Okay, so it's got all the metals it needs. That's pretty dope. No more walking in the water for this guy. Bravo, Sam. That bridge should make life easier for a lot of people. You can be sure that every traveler in quarter who passes that way will put it to good use. Keep an eye on for other spots that could do with another well-placed bridge. Okay, so I believe the power station is up that way, right? Yep. Or the wind farm. What is this? Custom marker. Oh, that, that was where we went before, that mule camp. Build our watch watchtower up there. So yeah, we'll head up to the power station up this way. Okay, so those heal you. <gasps> what is that? Yeah. Oh wait, did I just... Give that guy money? Whoops. Always like the quiet. I see the strands coming down in the rainbow. Does that mean there's gonna be BTs up this way? I wonder if the, you could do that, like kind of just look in the air. No, because there's strands over there too. Yeah, maybe that those are does that signify maybe BTs in the area? I liked where he peed. What? I did see a thing about peeing, though. Maybe I gotta take a piss. How do I pee?
There it is. When you gotta go, you gotta go. There. Oh, I got a big ass mushroom. Uh, way station west of capital. Oh, grab it. VIP life, thank you for the sum, I appreciate it. It's heavy as fudge. Okay, we're almost maxed out again. Damn it. It's okay. We should we should save a lot of weight once we get up here. Oh, it's starting to rain. The wind is blowing me over, man. Mike Todd, thank you for the sub, brother. I could I could deliver some of the stuff in this mailbox here. I'll just deliver it here. That way we don't got to worry about it. I miss Paul's gifts. Get out of here. Hold on. Why doesn't the gifted subs make a noise, dude? Paul, brother, man. Seriously, thank you so much with the five gifted members uh, and everybody who received one of those. I, I could already see you guys got the hearts in the chat. Make sure you thank Paul. He's always showing mega love. I really appreciate that, brother. All right, let me see here. Looks like some cargo has been transported to its destination on your behalf. You can access the share locker to collect it. So now we're good. Especially if there's BTs up here. Bro, there's this medicine right here. Let's. You know I gotta deliver it, guys. That's what I do. That's what I do. So now we're out of network. This place is actually further. I don't know why I thought I was almost to it. 
Oh, yeah, this is getting rough. I would have grabbed that package, but I just can't right now. Fuck, I almost walked off the damage. I wonder if we can anchor this. Helen done, baby. He's nearby. Of course, sir. Damn it. Yeah, we're gonna need it to get out of here. That that's why I left the rope there. We're gonna need it to get back. Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, that happened. Shit. So this thing is damaged now. Can I- I could repair it though, right? Container repair spray, yep. Yeah. Um, how do- how do I actually use it though? Container repair spray... So I wonder, do I gotta put the container on the ground or something? I think I gotta- I think I actually have to take the container off. Get our container repair spray. Yo, that was fucked, dude. Oh, you could have spray it on yourself? Oh, point back. Oh, uh, okay, okay, I see. I see, okay. Yo, that was crazy, dude. Like, what happened? I don't, I don't even know what happened. Yeah, I should check on BB, right? Oh, it won't let me. Yeah, it won't let me check on BB. Yo, that's what happens when you get caught by the BT? Hey, kid. <laughs> Beginning scan. Scanning Bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. All weapons will remain locked until departure. Cargo verified. Thank you. But look how dirty we are now. We need that shower. I don't know if the windmill place is going to have a private room, though. Delivering I should... Cargo. You know what I should have... I should have threw the fucking piss grenades, man. Thank you. With this unit, we should be able to power the distro center via the chiral network. Leo, thank you for the sub. Too, if it works. Here's hoping the UCA can put our electricity to good use. Mind if I have a look? Incredible. How'd you get this here? You fly? Mint condition. You would never know. Or was it? Or maybe it wasn't mint condition. It had 14% damage. Maybe I should have sprayed it some more. Source and every structure you build consumes it. However, as you increase your connection level, the bandwidth available to you will increase as well. You 
You can now use the PCC to build generators. There it is. All right, guys. So now we can build that generator. We did our part. Thanks again. You know, I heard the rest of your team was wiped out. Makes what you're doing all the more incredible. You're a one-man expedition. I hope Romilly's doing as well as you. Wonder if she made it to Edgenot City yet. It was her that put us in charge of the wind farm. I was with the group bringing up. Allison, thank you for the sub. The I appreciate it. I've never met her in person, but it was an honor to travel with her all the same. When you see her. Feel free to tell her I said so, huh? Sam, got a moment? I ran an experiment with your blood. It seems you were onto something. After dispersing an aerosolized sample of your blood in BT territory, we observed reduced activity. While this is hardly definitive as we have no other repatriates to whom we can turn for additional testing, it does suggest that the bodily fluids of repatriates a repellent to BTs. You tell that to the one that Probably almost sucked me into the fucking weapon to the abyss. The, the prototype should be ready soon. And when it is, we'd like you to test it. Sam, this is the perfect opportunity. We've almost got the whole region on the Cairo network. All that's left is Port Knot City. Return to Capital Knot City so you can pick up relief supplies for Port Knot. By the time you arrive, we can give you the completed prototype in person. One other thing, it's not very often porters get out to that wind farm. While you're there, you should pick up any outstanding orders. No sense coming all the way back here empty-handed if there's work to be done. Have a look at that delivery terminal. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further... Congrats, Sam. You're cleared to take on open orders. While they're not as high priority as the ones specifically assigned to you, if you're already heading a certain way and you have room to spare, it couldn't hurt to do a little more, right? Max? Just because they're not mission critical doesn't mean they're not important to someone. So why not do a good deed or two? Definitely could do a good deed or two. There's always the R2, That's you know what I mean? For material transport. By helping the facility replenish its stores, you'll gain access to a greater share of the materials on site. Give, and you shall receive. Okay, so delivery power supply, inspection tools, metals, and more metals. Yeah, so we'll take these. Might be crossing back through BT territories. Hey, great work. That wind farm you've brought into the network is essential for our continued expansion. By way of reward, I've added a little something to your PCC. A generator option. Generators recharge the batteries of all nearby devices. That includes machines, bikes, and other battery-powered vehicles. Okay, so we'll carry that on our back. Carry that on our back. Yeah, so now we we have access to the generator, which means we can now charge that bike that was sitting out front of that uh the distribution center. I'll take these tools also. Uh, the only thing I want to fabricate is this one of these. But uh, you know, we'll wait till we get back. I don't. I don't need that right now. Um, yeah, we should be good with this. Got our metals. We got the tools. Got an anchor, a ladder. Still got some repair spray, and our boots are still. They're about halfway done. 
Uh, guys, I want to thank you for over 800 likes on this stream. That is huge. So, for for those of you guys in chat, how many times, is, how many of you guys, this is your first time ever seeing this game? A lot of first timers there it is it, hey it's the first time for me too guys really getting into this so like i said if you guys want to see more and hey, make sure you smash i'm pretty sure the game's going to keep getting crazier and crazier i from what i've heard um it's one of those games that start off slow and that might be why a lot of people just dismiss it and don't really pay much attention um because it's a lot of just this but even the walking around and shit we haven't it's not i haven't i would say it hasn't been so like Oh my god, like, you're walking for like 30, it's like 5 minutes, you know, to go from point to point. And then those damn monsters, they make shit stressful. Oh, so that one got destroyed. Okay, I got my rope over here somewhere. You do walk. You do do a bit of walking, but I mean, you know, we're only a couple hours into the game. And like, yeah, you walk, but the, the walking is... It's like a puzzle, you know what I mean? You gotta figure out how to get from point to point. And some of this terrain is crazy. Like, I got my rope here. My rope. Well, I wonder how much. Oh, it's gonna take a ton of stamina to climb in this, ain't it? Oh, that's not too bad. Going through these mountains like this, I really can't afford to get any more weight on me. Yeah, I should be fucking picking up those little crystals, shouldn't I? Here in a couple minutes, I'm going to show you guys. We're going to try to turn this not into a walking simulator. So we can we can we can show people that there's there is another way.
Now, I don't know if I have a PCC on. No, I don't have one on me. I gotta, I gotta get one made really quick. Tell me if it wasn't, bro. See you around. Would he tell me if it wasn't? By handing over excess materials to a facility, you can increase the amount stored on site. Now, these materials can then be used later for equipment fabrication and so forth. Just remember that each facility has separate oh, stores and that the amount on hand differs from site to site. Don't get carried away. Um... Okay, so okay, in trust cargo for Sam. If you'd like someone to take should have Yep, yep, yep. In trust, get rid of these. Okay, so now we're going to fabricate a, uh, a PCC. Uh, actually, no, 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 no. I, I have one in my private locker, I believe, right? Yep, I, I've got a bunch in my private locker, actually, so we'll carry that on our back. I almost freaking wasted resources. Thank you. All right, so let's go ahead and see. You could probably get that bike running again if you charged it with a generator. Why not give it a try? Listen, lady, you don't even gotta tell me. Generator. And anything in this circle will charge, right? We need a shower, dude. Fully charged, guys. And they said the game was a walking simulator. Boost wheel spin, drift, wheelie. You could jump with it.
Oh, this thing is super agile. Charge doesn't last super long, though. At least from what I... Oh, no, maybe it did. So now all we gotta do is figure out how to get a gun. Oh, yeah, I was boosting the whole time, pretty much, yeah. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Yeah, I was definitely boosting the whole time. Your work is great. Damn, dude. Know those marks all too well, guys. A lot of you guys probably don't know uh, all that red shit that he has on his shoulders there. Um, it's it's from packs. Like when I was in the military, and you know, especially when I was in Afghanistan and shit, I had a pack on every single day, everywhere we went. Um, and the, with the straps and shit laying, just laying on your shoulders, uh, that's what you get. You just get permanent, just pack rash right on your freaking shoulders. It's terrible. So we don't have the other suits here. All right, so there we go. All right, guys, so we're going to end this episode here. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying it. 850 likes, that's absolutely crazy. Uh, next episode, we're going to be going and, you know, pushing forward and seeing where the hell else this. What are you pointing at, dude? Norman, you're freaking... You want to go check on the baby, dude? I already, I already rocked the baby, guys. I already rocked the baby. You guys remember when I rocked the baby? Chat was, uh... Getting out. It wasn't me, guys. I was not rocking the baby like that. That was, that was all on him. That was all on him. <laughs> But no, I do appreciate you guys hanging out. Like I said, we're going to be doing one more stream tonight. So um, if you guys want to come and hang out, we're probably going to play some State of Decay. Um, but thank you, thank you guys. I had a great time. I, I am absolutely loving this game. The story is going to seems very intriguing. And uh, it's weird. It's freaking weird, man. <laughs> so uh, again, thank you, thank you so much. I appreciate all the love and support tonight. Um, if you guys had it on your way out, hey, smash that like button. You guys know you're the most sophisticated bots on YouTube. <laughs> oh, there it is. Uh, but yeah, I, I do appreciate it. And uh, if you guys are new to the channel, hey, consider subscribing. 
You know, we just hit 60,000 around our way to 61K already. But uh, all right, guys. Thank you. Thank you. See you in the next one. Peace.